Michael Carrick is a 13-year-old boy who's already been tipped as one of this country's future footballing stars. This is his story. My name's Michael Carrick. I'm 13. I play for Walsham Boys Club. I know, like, people see that, like, the next Peter Beardsley and things like that, but... It never, it never bothers us. I just keep playing football now for the boys club. It never bothers us. Yeah, it's quite like a few clubs like interested. I've been to a couple of them, but like I still haven't been to all of them yet. And I, like I'm still going like on trial with some of them. Um, I've been to West Ham, Newcastle, Chelsea, Crystal Palace. Um, I'm meant to be going to Wimbledon, um, Swindon. Nottingham Forest. Um, there's a couple more as well. Can't remember the one. I first started playing football when I was four and a half in the boys' club. When I was, I was just a five or seven. But I started playing eleven or seven when I was nine. In the boys' club, like most people know each other. Like when you walk in the door, like most, like you know nearly everybody who's there. Like you've seen them and that. But like, it's like quite friendly. The principal aim of the, of the Rose End Boys Club is to give the kids in the area a game of football. And the philosophy is, if they're good enough, we will try and help them to become better players. The mines have closed, the local pits have all gone there. The shipyard's just about closed now. It's finishing off the last order. There's only 100 employees left, and they're all just waiting for the final acts to come. There's very little opportunities for work for adults. Never mind, never mind the kids. And I think. They see football as a way out. Three months a week for the boys club. Sometimes you do like ball skills, sometimes you do like practicing with corners or free kicks. Or like just working on the defence one week and then working on the midfield and then working on the forwards. The managers they just they like voluntary and if they don't listen if like you're not taking like part. It's just a waste of their time. If you didn't turn up for training, like, with a good reason, you would just, you'd drop you for the week. But it, if you kept, like, doing it and never turn up for training, you'd probably, you'd look for another player. If you just want to turn up and play, well, you're not learning anything, really. These are the trophies I've won over the years. That one's for winning Player of the Year for the town under 12. That one's for winning the cup for the boys' club and under 12s as well. But this one's my favourite one because it was my first trophy player of the year for the boys' club and I wasn't expecting to get it, so it made us even more pleased. My mum cleans my boots as far as my dad cleans them because when I come in, I just dump them at, hey, beside the sink. She says you should clean your boots, she says well I was going to, but like you've got there first. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Vit. Mr. Vit. Mum and Dad, like, if I wanted to move from Wall's End or anything like that, which I don't like, but, but like, if I did, they would like, they'd say that whatever I'd, I'd done, they would like support us. And like, my Dad always tells us if I had a bad game, but like, he says I like, they would always support us whatever I'd done. And I'm sitting in the changing room, so I just like think about how we're playing and if they're any good. I feel like we should beat them. Don't get nervous before games. When I get the ball, I like try and just like give it to other players. I lay it off. Like I don't always just go to try and score goals myself. I try to give it to other players to give them a chance as well. Michael's strengths at the moment is probably what he's always had. His, his awareness of what's going on around him, his balance is terrific, and he's, he's very quick to see to see a, an opportunity. I think on the downside at the moment is he's grown rather quickly, and he hasn't got the strength to go with it yet. But that'll come. The strength will come. You can always put strength into a player, but you can't put skill into them. And Michael's got an awful lot of skill. I can't sign like schoolboy forms until I'm 14. 
I'm not 14 until July, so I've got plenty of time like look around different clubs and that. I enjoy like playing football, but you could easily get injured or anything could happen. So like the school work, the school work's really important. Cause, like you need it for different things for to get a job and that when you're older. I don't know if I will become a professional footballer, but I hope I do. But like, there's still a long way to go now, so anything could happen. My ambition would like to be to score a goal for England in the World Cup final, but I would just like first just like play for England at any level really.